Hey everybody and welcome to my very first mod review here for Farming Simulator 19. Rev over in my Discord uh, pointed me to three interesting placeable objects uh, over at ModHoster.com. Uh, you'll be able to find links to those mods in the description. Uh, but basically, let's let's take a look at them in the store. So if we go to the store and we go to Miscellaneous, then we scroll over a little bit, we'll see that we have a Lime Station, a Liquid Fertilizer Station, and a seed station. Okay, these are all uh, placeable fill points. So something that is not available on either map other than lime are bulk seed um, fill points, uh, bulk liquid fertilizer fill points, and then there is, of course, one lime fill point, which is here on Ravenport, way over here on this side of the map. Well, I know placeable refill points are fairly popular so i thought i'd do a little bit of a uh, mod review here on these three fill, fill points so if we go to the store we get miscellaneous again we uh five thousand dollars we can just uh plop them down of course we can use q and e to rotate the map or we can use the arrow keys left and right to rotate uh the fill point we just put it down there. So that one is lime. Then we have liquid fertilizer. And then we have seeds. Let's go ahead and spin it around here so that we have our labels. Okay. Let's go over here and take a little closer look at them. They're nothing super special. Uh, they are pretty much... I think more like Farm Sim 17 uh, placeables because you don't have the option of raising and lower them, lowering them uh, like you do with the you know, new placeable system. You don't have uh, the terraforming going on and everything. But if you want to uh, put one of these fill points at your local farm or just scattered around the map uh, just for the convenience sake, then they are now available over at ModHoster.com. So let's run up here to uh, field 13. I've got some already set up. Let's go ahead and jump on in our magnum here. And you can see we've got some pallets uh, here where I've already tested these out. So let's go ahead and pull up here to our liquid fertilizer fill point. And we just hit R to start filling. We'll see where we are filling down there at the bottom. So 2,200 liters for $2,600. Not a bad price at all uh, for liquid fertilizer. And put that down. Let's go over here and pick up our solid fertilized spreader and lime spreader. Pull on in here. We get the start filling, so let's go ahead and fill that up. And see how much uh, this takes and how much it cost us. Rotate that so we can see the price a little bit better. So 9,000 liters of lime. And that's $2,024. Okay. Now let's go ahead and we've got this uh, Vanderstand cedar here. As I drive over it. Let's go ahead and come on around here to our seed fill point. And you'll see that we do not have a refill yet. So we first thing we have to do is we have to open the cover. And then we get to start refilling. And refill that. And we'll see what the price is. So 2,800 liters for $2,500. These seem to be very cost effective ways to, uh, to fill your cedar your caulk 
our lime um, spreader and your liquid fertilizer spreader. If we look here at our pallets, so a pallet of liquid fertilizer is $2,400 for 2,000 liters. And then if we go back to bio bags, seed is $1,000 or $900 for 1,000 liters. And lime is $450 for 2,000 liters. So guys, I hope you liked this uh, mod review. And I hope you go check out those mods over at ModHoster.com if you are interested. And until next time, happy farming.